down low, guys. Welcome back to American Truck Simulator. So today, guys, we're in the 100th anniversary edition of the W900. SCS did release this truck. Uh, the trailer is a STS trailer. The, uh, the paint job was found on the Steam Workshop. Anybody wants it? Now, you can automatically get this truck at the Kenworth dealership. I did add a few uh, on things on to it that it did not come with, but let's go around. So, Kenworth has celebrated 100 years of building trucks, which is phenomenal. Look at this truck. Now, SCS did do a stream, and they said that they totally reworked this truck from the ground up. But the old model that was in the game, they had to rework it completely. So this is a totally brand new truck. As you can see, all the decals on the truck, the 100th anniversary edition there. I will go through everything in the truck. Now, I'm going to stream it again. I, I did do a stream of this truck, and the stream ended early. Uh, I've been having some issues with Shadow Play, so... On the ending streams early. Turn left. So I will be doing it again to make up for the. I did remove that string. I'm sorry, guys. I can't talk today. Still asleep. I did remove that string. Because uh, I, I would not have that on my channel. That, that's uh, not good quality content, and I won't have Go that. Go Bakersfield, California, we're going to Santa Cruz. Right now. We got 136 miles. We'll get a thumbnail. Go straight. Matter of fact, I'm going to go ahead and get one right now. Oh, she's beautiful. Beautiful truck. You know, and this is one thing that I've said, you know, I've said this many times. Um, I have nothing against none of the modders in this game. Now, these modders do an awesome job, but SCS is just getting better and better making these trucks. I mean, this truck is so much better than the old model. And... Imagine what, what you know what we got coming. You know they they did say that they would be back with Kenworth later this year. So that means that both like we'll be getting the next generation T680. Which is gonna be awesome to see. But, you know, and, and this is something Kenworth did say. He said that this truck is still the most wanted truck on the road. They have more orders for the W900 than they do any truck that they make. It's still the most desirable truck for truck drivers. They love these trucks. I'll go over all the customization options when we get done the run. And come out and join us for the stream.
have, I'm still waiting on um, script hook to update my LSPDFR. Um, Rockstar updated GTA 5 again and broke everything like normal. Um, LSPDFR and Red Hook has updated. We're waiting on script hook to update. Um, I can't do anything until it updates because then I'm going to have to see if I'm going to have to reinstall the mod for it. If I had to reinstall the mod footer, that means all the cars have to be reinstalled. It's going to take me a while to get everything put back together. We're not here to talk about that today. We're here to talk about this beautiful truck. 100th anniversary edition of the W900 and Kenworth. As far as Kenworth goes, 100 years. A great milestone for the company. quiet right now. Also guys, modded trucks, I, I'm still making my decisions on what we're going to do about that. I'm going to be I'm going to be running modded trucks. I got to figure out how I'm going to do it. But I'm going to do it uh, every week, uh, every two weeks. I have not quite decided on everything yet. play this game and you have mods for the old W900 remove them because when I when the tr game first updated I went to the garage right. and there was an issue right. I had some mods of horn mods for the old W900 and it's causing issues with this truck 
and it's causing it not to have a steering wheel. Exit right. And some other problems. So once I remove that mod, uh, it worked fine. So if you have any mods, uh, remove them. Left. tight turn. Yeah, that was a tight one there. Get ready to turn right. Turn right. Well, they want it. Oh, they want it there this time. Okay. Changing it up. Beautiful machine. Beautiful truck. I always love the look of this truck. So I bought two of these trucks, guys, as soon as they got to work. I bought the regular one that I could put in my fleet with my other trucks, and I bought this 100th anniversary edition. I don't use the tracker R, so it's kind of easier for me to back it like this. But I can see out that mirror pretty good back there.
I like the fact that two of the stacks are not sticking out much as they used to. You can actually can uh, you can actually back it up pretty good now. So we drove extra, we drove 141 miles, it took us four hours and nine minutes to get here, we consumed 19.3 gallons of fuel. All right, we're here. We don't want to go all the way up there, that's going to Montana. We're in St. Martin, that's going to Santa Cruz. Take us some cigarettes, we could do that. Fresno's. Flurry mix. We're not gonna do this right now, so I'm gonna go ahead and get loaded up though. Alright guys, that's going to be it for today's video. I want to get in here and do one of this, uh, well, the 100th anniversary edition of the W900. Celebrate 100 years of Kenworth. Congratulations to them. That is, it is a milestone. And one that they, uh, that they are proud of, I know. So thank you for everyone who watched the channel. Everyone who's been subscribing, watching the live stream, supporting the channel. Thank you. And if you're new to the channel and you like the content, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification. When I go live or uh, upload video, video will be coming back to the channel very soon. And uh, we'll see you later.